Live to leave a legacy for God's glory. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Joe Stoll. While staying in a hotel in a small town, Joe noticed that the church across the street was having a service. People were jammed into the church, with a standing room only crowd of both young and old flowing out onto the sidewalk. When he noticed a hearse by the curb, Joe realized it was a funeral. And given the crowd, he assumed that it was the celebration of the life of some local hero, perhaps a wealthy business person or famous personality. Curious, Joe said to the desk clerk, That's an amazing turnout for a funeral. It must be for a famous person in town. No, he replied, he wasn't rich or famous, but he was a good man. This reminded Joe of the wisdom of the proverb that says, A good name is more desirable than great riches. It's a good idea to think about what kind of legacy we are leaving for our family, friends, and neighbors. From God's perspective, it's not our resume or the amount of money we've accumulated that matters, but rather the kind of life we've lived. When a friend of Joe's passed away, his daughter wrote, This world has lost a righteous man, and in this world that is no small thing. It's that kind of legacy that we should be seeking for the glory of God. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Proverbs chapter 22, verses 1 through 16. A good name is more desirable than great riches. To be esteemed is better than silver or gold. Rich and poor have this in common. The Lord is the maker of them all. The prudent see danger and take refuge, but the simple keep going and pay the penalty. Humility is the fear of the Lord. Its wages are riches and honor and life. In the paths of the wicked are snares and pitfalls, but those who would preserve their life stay far from them. Start children off on the way they should go, and even when they are old, they will not turn from it. The rich rule over the poor, and the borrower is slave to the lender. Whoever sows injustice reaps calamity, and the rod they wield in fury will be broken. The generous will themselves be blessed, for they share their food with the poor. Drive out the mocker, and out goes strife. Quarrels and insults are ended. One who loves a pure heart and who speaks with grace will have the king for a friend. The eyes of the Lord keep watch over knowledge, but he frustrates the words of the unfaithful. The sluggard says, There's a lion outside. I'll be killed in the public square. The mouth of an adulterous woman is a deep pit. A man who is under the Lord's wrath falls into it. Folly is bound up in the heart of a child, but the rod of discipline will drive it far away. One who oppresses the poor to increase his wealth and one who gives gifts to the rich, both come to poverty. That's today's scripture reading from Proverbs chapter 22, verses 1 through 16. Let's pray. Lord, help me to pursue a life that is pleasing to you and honors your name. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.